problem is with Mr. Rife is I think he disconnected from his audience. He disconnected. That I, that's ex- the perfect way to say it. Yes. You know, I fucking love comedy. I do love comedy. I do. Isn't it great? Like, yes. There's so many good comedians out there. The, yes. You know. My whole thing is I, I think Dave Chappelle, I grew right? up with It's him. like the pinnacle. Amazing. Loved his show. Yeah. He just knows. The show he makes, he makes you hilarious. laugh at whatever he does, he right? He does. Even when he's serious about he's shit. He's real smart. It's funny. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I like Andrew Schultz. He's funny. Right? Even though I think the people said that he, he got too high and mighty over himself. Yeah. Kevin Hart is always funny. Kevin Hart is phenomenal. Okay. Um, Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy. Uh, recently, I like Shane Gillis. Shane Gillis. I yeah, I know. I know. I, I think he's he hilarious. He sent me tons of videos. Oh, of my God. I love yeah. that guy. Yeah, yeah Shane, he's funny. Shane, if you're ever in Jersey, <laughs> come on the yeah, show. Yeah, yeah. We'd love it. All right. Hilarious. That'd be good. Um, And then I, I, I like Matt Rice. Yeah, I mean, the clips that he would put up, it's just funny. He's just really funny. Yeah, yeah, you watch all the you know? clips. And then I watched the, you know, the most recent Netflix. Oh, his special? Yeah, and, and I came was, out with that I crazy, left, the joke. It left me a little, you know, I wasn't, it wasn't that great. Bitter taste? Bitter, yeah. I was yeah. just like, and then they started, you know, going at him because he was talking about a woman with a black eye. Yeah, talking about, this. okay, listen, I understand the joke, right? The joke didn't bother me at all. Yeah. Right? It's a joke. You got to understand. You just got to be like, ha ha, let's move on to the next mm-hmm. next thing, right? That's the way um, I see it. I now, mean, whether he saved himself by stating that, you know, he was testing the waters yeah. just to see, fine. You know, whatever. Comedians are going to be a comedian, okay? Yeah. But you can't knock him for that. If you don't like it, then don't watch it. Don't watch it. it. That's it. Or change the channel or close your ears until the next joke comes. Um, that's not the issue with him. And he was he was up here. Bro, he was, I mean, up here. He was, yeah. Really high and up. He, like, surpassed a lot of people instantaneously. He did, instantaneously. Right? And that's because of the, his looks. Very handsome gentleman. Okay. Yeah, listen, he's a good-looking kid. Absolutely. Okay? And He was women, on Wild and Out, and he wasn't that popular. Yes. And he got jacked and stuff. Yeah. Women blew him up because of their emotions. All right? They got a little wet, and he fucking, he, he made skyrocketed. a... Skyrocketed. He skyrocketed, okay? He did. He was a good-looking and, guy. And he had everything. Yeah. So I don't know if this guy has an agent or friends yeah. that maybe giving him the wrong information or whatever. But if I was his friend, I would have been like, bro, just continue what you're doing. Exactly. And don't, and don't shut answer the fuck everyone. Up. Yes. He's answering people. That's the problem. That is the problem. And not only that is he's showing that that the way people think about him is bothering him. It is bothering him. Okay. Like, well, I'm not a com- I'm a comedian. I don't just do crowd work. But if that's all the fucking shit you're posting. Yeah. On TikTok is yeah. crowd work and it's blowing you up. Continue doing Continue fucking doing crowd that. work, Rip, bro. Start ripping the crowd and yes. people love it. Who gives You're a great shit? At it. Rip the fucking crowd. Yeah. Then that's your whole show. You don't even need to write jokes after that. No, you can just walk around and yes. just fuck people. Just be witty, be sarcastic, yeah. understand, you know, boom, boom, back and forth. Oh, yeah. You know, pick. Pick the, 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 you know, best looking people, the ugly looking people, whatever you want. Interracial, you just, whatever yes, you do, yeah. You can just work the Old crowd, ladies, man. yeah, you work the crowd. Yeah, that was, I thought, his niche. And then when the, he started telling jokes, it didn't, like, I didn't receive it the way I would a Kevin Hart joke, or I would, like, it yeah, was just, yeah. like Kevin, it kind of fell flat a little for I'll me. I'll put it this way, right? The jokes that I like to hear yeah. are stories. Stories about... Your kids. Yes. About it's funny. Yes. All right. Like you know? uh, Like I, I can talk recently. Like Shane Gillis. Okay. We'll talk about recently with him. I like his comedy because number one, he makes fun of himself. He and makes that's fun important. of his family. That's funny. Right? And 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 what, the way he tells a joke, it's like you feel like you're a part of that guy's life. Yep. And you know him better. Yeah. So it's like you know, it makes it even funnier. You're standing in a circle with him. Yes. And he's exactly, telling you the joke. Right. Like yeah. like he like you can invite him over. And he'll just hang out down here with us, yes. normal. Yeah. Like, you don't got to feel awkward that you don't know him. You no. know what I'm saying? Exactly. So, that, they, like, Dave Chappelle does that. You he know does. what I'm saying? Uh, Kevin they, Hart does they that. They draw you in. Yes. They draw you yes. in. Yes. Like, even Kevin Hart, when he talks about his children. Yeah. Or even back in the day, when he would be, like, you know, mad at his mom, he'd go to his room, like, Wah! You know what I'm saying? Like, this. I thought, <laughs> like, uh, everybody did that. with his flops. Yes. And it's so funny you, stuff. Exactly. So, yeah. you feel one with that guy. You do. You, you connect. Know what I'm saying? Yes. The problem is with Mr. Rife is. I think he disconnected from his audience. He disconnected. That I, that's ex- the perfect way to say yes, it. Yes, he disconnected from his audience, and a lot of people do go to that show for the crowd work. Yeah. And it's been said. 
Because it's hilarious. Yes. Now he took that 180. Didn't want to do that because he's all like, uh, you know, I'm a comedian. I'm a comedian. Like, don't come to my show and expect me to do crowd work. I'll do it when I feel like it. Yeah. Like, it's like, it's like, listen, I'm sorry, kid. Shut the fuck up and do the fucking crowd work. Okay. Yeah. Like, if I was your agent, your niche, if dude. I was your agent, yeah, I would have been like, bro. Do go, the fucking crowd work. Go after the crowd. Yeah, that's the money maker. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? And he's and he thinks quick. Like, like so. Andrew Schultz does that nonstop. Yeah. Crowd. He doesn't post little he does post little clips on nah, it. Yeah, but right? not like but he didn't way blow back up then. with that porn stash he's got. Yeah. But what I'm saying is <laughs> he still he still blew up. Yeah. But people know that if they go to the show, he's gonna pick on you a little bit. Absolutely. But the rest of his jokes yeah. are story time funny. Yeah. And that's what I like. Yeah, I, I and think And he's he, very witty where he knows about cultures yeah. and religions and and you know he has that knowledge in the background to hit you good right Agreed. like he's the indian kid that, that he's friends with too i forgot his name akash maybe know. no what, what is I his name? name um man i watch him all he's on that flagrant two show with him or flagrant whatever yeah he uh, i was watching a, a, a show with him and he was talking to another indian gentleman and the indian gentleman said he was like a pastor and yeah. right away he already knew like his name wh and where he came from yeah. and that is knowledge you get what I'm saying yeah. obviously you know Indian against Indian but yeah, I got it's, you. It's, it's, it's knowledge about yeah. that shot and when the comedians have that kind of knowledge it's awesome but I feel like Matt Reif has lost that niche the edge the edge yes yeah. and then the second half of the, of the thing is it's like alright dude people are talking shit let it blow over Yeah. No, you had to hit back. He did. With that link to the special helmets. Yeah. And then you're t you're on this girl's show telling them that you yeah. thought people were jealous of you. Yeah. And then you're just telling people that, you, you know. You look butthurt. Yes. And I'm like, dude, like. Now, he was just, on Jordan Peterson. Okay. I, I haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen so it yet. So when either. it comes out, maybe it'll clear the air about everything. I hope so. Just, okay. you know what, just keep going forward. The, yeah. the people, when you're at the top, people are going to throw rocks. Yeah. That's what like, it is. Listen, we even got a little chubby for fucking Matt Reif. Yeah. Because oh, the, we did. Yeah, because I liked seeing the funny jokes. Yeah, it was hilarious. And everything on TikTok, and on I Twitter, loved, I on, the on, yeah, on, on YouTube, it was clip. Yep. So technically, he became not a full-fledged comedian. He became a clip com comedian. Like yeah. clip, clip comedy. Yeah. So if you just... Continue with the clips. That's what works. Yes. That's it, what's it was making you money. For him. Yeah. You, you don't even got to sell out a show, dude. No. Just make fucking clips of yourself in the basement. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I like, know. be in front of us and we'll just laugh. But <laughs> the camera will be on you. Yeah. And just make clips of that shit. Yeah. You, you get what I, I'm saying? I, no, I get what you're saying. I, I think you got to go with what you're good at. Yes. You know? Yes. So. Yes. You know what I mean? He kind of forgot. I think, I don't know if he lost himself or. But. Listen. It's a, it was a quick fall for it's me. It's like Notorious B.I.G. said, right? And this possibly could what happened. More money, more problems. Maybe yeah. he's making a lot of that money and it got to his head. Yeah. You know, maybe he is truly. You tend to lose yourself when you yeah, have a lot of money. Yeah, maybe he is truly one of those hot looking douches. I don't know. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. We're never going to know. We're never going to know until. he gets butthurt when he watches our shit. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Why don't you come on our show, right? If you're going on all these shows with females yeah, come, and whatever, bullshit. come on a, a, like a man show and talk with us here in Jersey like a man. And we'll get, you know, we'll go through it. Yeah. We'll, we'll ask you the hard fucking questions like we're your boys. I, yeah, I don't I, give a I fuck. Agree. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Right? We'll body you. We'll body you up. <laughs> I'll take my shirt off. We can hug. Right? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we, he'll do all that. What's it, Bert? The comedian Bert? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right? The machine, whatever. He'll take his shirt off. The machine. <laughs> the machine. That was funny. Right? <laughs> he'll fly, flex his fucking pecs that's for you. That's it. But that's what I'm saying. No, I know. Right? Yeah. But you're going on these hot female shows. These hot females are asking you these dumb fucking questions. Yeah. And you're, you're digging yourself more in a hole. Yeah. It's yeah. like, just, just shut the fuck up. Yeah. It's like, what do you say to the cop? I would love Not to cooperate. Much. But I want to see my lawyer. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you got to say, right? You want to see your fucking lawyer, That's man. It. That's it. All right? Keep your money in your pocket. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it goes down to. <laughs> Come on our show.